Hello and welcome back to my let's play on Total War Free Kingdoms with Sima Young on Legendary Difficulty. Where last time left off we had a relatively difficult battle waiting for us with a pretty large army up against us. Uh, which has a trebuchet as well. Luckily no explosive shot though so it's not going to be that crazy good anyway. But still, it is something to be slightly worried about. We have to win this battle. Uh, if we do we should be able to take the final town of Sima Luna and we can start focusing on someone else who... I guess would have been Sima, I think it's Sima Jong to our south, although I still have all kinds of treaties with him. So if I were to do that, I would have to certainly make sure to uh, break those soon. But I'm not 100% sure yet exactly what the plan is. I believe, though, after this, there's nothing else on this island, well, island this landmass, I suppose, um, north and, and east of the Yellow River, uh, for me to take. So I do have to, you know, start thinking about attacking someone else. Could attack the Jin Empire, but I'm trading with them. Although the trade has been null for ages, so... Anyway, first of all, let's pop our army back here. Uh, I am kind of tempted to keep my trebuchet up front. Just... No, I'm not going to do that, though. So I can... Um, so my trebuchet is the first thing that can start targeting their trebuchets right away. Without them hitting my units, essentially. But I have loose formation available, too. So I think I'm just going to loose formation it up. And uh, we're just going to deal with that instead. Because in loose formation, and then... Oops, that's not loose formation. Um, and then, yeah, no no explosive shot or anything. Their, their shots aren't really going to do that much damage. Our cab is fully replenished, but uh, a bit weak. Which is unfortunate. I also didn't check how much cab they have. That would have been a great thing to know. I'm actually going to run into that forest up there, actually. Uh, you guys are going to sit up front here. You're going to sit back there. Uh, okay. Wait, hello. Let's not forget any more units, shall we? I wonder if I put if I leave them out of loose formation, if they're if they're actually legitimately gonna move up and focus on those two units. I actually kinda be would be interested to, to find out whether that's true or not. Hey you. I also could use the uh juice on my calf to make them waste all of their ammo, but it is a bit cheesy. But I I don't know. They probably just sat back there waiting for their reinforcements. I would definitely prefer if they came and attacked me right away, but... I suppose that's probably too much to ask for. Let's see if I get across this hill. Do I even have vision right here? I don't think I do. Hello? Oh yeah, it's a night battle too, so my morale is going to be kind of shot to pieces as well. Well, that's okay. We are... Relatively experienced, so morale is not a huge issue. Where the fuck is the enemy at? Where the fuck are you all at? There's gonna be some massive fucking line covering half the map in a second, coming out of nowhere. I can guarantee it. Oh, right, I was gonna put you guys in the forest. Probably a good idea to do that too. I mean, probably. It's whatever, right? Um, some. Wait, there's actual people there. No, it's abandoned. An abandoned camp. Where the fuck is the enemy? Are they not coming? Is it a no-show? Oh, hello. How the fuck did I just not see them from over <laughs> What the fuck? I'm sorry, but what is that vision? <laughs> Move over like five feet and like, oh, there's an entire army in front of me. Uh, okay, no one wants to duel except for perhaps Sima Shu. Uh, I would definitely duel him if you were so inclined. He's apparently hidden. But this guy looks an awful lot like him. Uh, Sima Fu. Well, that's fair enough. Yeah, there's actually... Is that an identical portrait? Wait. Damn it, I keep... Wait, if I just unselect my own... I can't, because I, I, that's not possible. I think that is an identical portrait. I mean, to be fair, one is Sima Fu and the other one is Sima Fu, so I suppose they're family. Oh, fuck, they've got a trebuchet, which is why they're sitting back. Oh, oopsie. Right. Um... Yeah, something like that we'll have to do, I guess. Except you guys can linger in the forest. Asking you to boyosh. Get in there. Oh, they're coming now. Why? Wait, maybe they were waiting for their reinforcements to arrive. Okay, they've got four units of cab, it seems. I can always stop my moving when I need to, though. Where's their treb? Where is thine treb? Tell me now, or you will regret it, sir. I'm also still waiting for their reinforcements, so I don't know what's going on right now. 
these trebuchets being up there would be a horrible, horrible. There it is. Whoop! There it is. It's charging up already, but there's no way anything is in range except for perhaps my generals. But they wouldn't. You wouldn't fire at my generals now, would you? I want my trebuchets up on this hill here. Might mean that I'm not firing at them for a little bit. Oh, we're getting fucking shot! We're in range already! Well, I, I'm, I, as I said, I will take that. I'll take it all the way to the bank! Okay, they're coming at me right now. I'm gonna... Retreat! Retreat! Up to back here. And you guys are just gonna set up right there. You guys are fine in the forest. You guys are gonna have to come back because there's way too much cam and stuff and the formation's way too long and my head hurts and <laughs> sorry. All right, does that other guy want a jewel? No, no one wants a jewel. Or him, okay, well fair enough. Shots fired! Shots fired Oh my god, this guy went flying down the hill. Now he's oh no. I was gonna say now he's getting trampled by his own men, but never mind. Never mind. Uh, look, if you want to come fight me, then I will happily oblige. Oh my god! I will not oblige because you're being shot. Although, having said that, let's not waste ammunition on them. Man, I have been in, in range for ages. I am definitely going to miss out on a lot of follies here, I'm afraid. I'm afraid that I will die. Okay, my cow's back there. These two are still hidden. As long as these guys don't go for the far flank, we should be fine over there. Let's pull them back just a tad, though, just in case. Just a tad, just in case. I need vision, holy shit. Pretty badly. We are in range of crossbows, too, and now we're not firing at all. Hello! <laughs> That's just so fucking weird. Gigantic army. Oh, yeah. There's an army there. Man, I forgot about that. How much ammo have they still got? They might not be able to see me anymore. No, they would, though, wouldn't they? But I can't see them. Uh, yeah, let's not lose formation anymore. Let's instead... Yeah, I guess you guys can stay in lose formation, because otherwise it's going to take too long to fix that. Oh, what the fuck happened there? Alright, well, we're committed now. Where's our cab at, though? Oh, hello. Oh, uh, hello. Uh, cavalry. It's time for you guys to start working right... Uh, still cab back there, though. But my cab is stronger than theirs. Damn right, it's stronger than theirs. I can teach you. But I'd have to murder you. Let's get you back to line. And you start... Demoralizing people. Get a fucking work! Oh, right, you guys might want to fire at will, actually. Oopsie. Oopsie daisy! Silly mistake there. Leave off a couple of them units right there. You need to start working around as well. Oh fuck, see, this is what I was afraid of. Get them boys. I'm gonna 1v1 that. I need to start working on some actual range units here. Or maybe even ignore them and charge in the back of all this shit right here, but then we're gonna get shot by them and that's not what we want either. That's not what I want. You're not the one that I want. Okay. Don't come towards me, you fiend. See you hang. Oh, they're stationary up. Yep, that was a bad idea. They weren't really in formation or anything, but they still became stationary, and that still fucks you. Get out of here. You are uh, gonna go kill someone. You. Go kill some dudes. Just do a. Really? Why can't I fucking do it? Let's do it, man. What the hell's wrong with you? Okay, being stationary there was not what I wanted to do. I don't know why you guys... Oh, because you murdered that unit. No, you didn't. Why were you stationary there? I will never know. Alright, we've got some more cabin there. Fucking keep going. Cabin here needs to get out of there. You did some work, though. That unit's about to rout. This isn't going to go well. Where are all my crossbows at? Oh! They've been murdered. Well. That was uh, unexpected. What the fuck happened there? <laughs> And we actually decided to target them? What the fuck? Alright, fair enough. Uh, you need to get back in here and pronto, because my goodness, are we not going to last very long here. Um, so I got two units of cav here. Where's my... Oh, the last one is stuck over here. I really don't like that. 
Still too busy murdering that. You need to get back over here and kill this man for me because this unit's not doing very well. Our entire flank here is faltering. This isn't going very well now, is it? I need my second army here. As it turns out. Oh, what a crazy prospect. There's a battle where you out. Fuck me, they're going be through here now. Jesus. Get some dudes out of here. I can't send you in anywhere, really. They've broken through here now. Having forgotten about you several times, this has not helped. Go kill that unit for me, please. Kill some of these generals. Ugh, you're stuck in melee of a calf unit. God! How are you losing this of all units? You should be... You're clearly winning that, though. Okay, we routed the general. Oh, God. This isn't, this isn't going well. I've got to say, I'm not sure exactly how it went so poorly, either. Just overwhelmed, I guess. Okay, get over here. There's way more infantry to murder. Get in there, trying to hold back as many units as possible. Uh, where's my cav around here? I got a unit of cav that doesn't need to be there anymore. Let's get him out here. This one, you finally won. Okay, let's hope that the unit doesn't come back. Ugh, they've sprouted. Yes, you need to charge in there and fucking well as well. Destroy that unit, please. Kill him if you can. You help out against that. You too, actually. Actually, you know what? I need some more fucking demoralization here. Okay, there's a significant amount of damage there. You are still charging in here. I gotta make sure they don't get stationary or anything, though. They are. Nope, they went to lose formation. Fuck! I thought they were forming up or something. Alright, try it anyway. Nope, that doesn't work. Never mind. Get in here. You've done your work. Go kill that unit again. You need to kill these people at least. Do something. But Trebuchet is still firing as well. That's impressive. Calf's coming back, but that should be okay. You need to just kind of get in here. You actually broke him. That was impressive, I gotta say. One has to admit. The thing is, we don't have to fucking... We don't have to have much of an army left here, as long as we win. Because we have a second army right there. You need to demoralize. Okay, you did a lot of damage there. He's gone mad because we killed someone, damn it. That was that one over there, then. Keep murdering. You need to get out of there now, charge in there instead. You need to just do that for a little bit, because why not? Surprised you're doing alright. Actually, you're not doing alright. You're dying. Of old age. But that's not the point. <laughs> uh, where's my calf? I feel like I'm missing one. Yes, I am missing one. There's one. I got a unit being idle. Oh, well, that's great. Charge in there. You guys are doing nothing as well. Get in there before this unit rouse, please. And uh, debuff the shit out of him. Keep murdering him, please. Someone was about to say something, this time I will have victory, and then he got interrupted by Shishu, like, nah, you're about to die, Sunny Jim. Okay, stand there and fucking hit him, please. That's all you gotta do. One more hit will probably do it. Okay, we broke that unit. Get in there. Uh, yeah, you kill this unit, that'd be great. Yeah, we're definitely gonna, not gonna have much left here, but we have. We're still gonna be besieging them, which means they're still gonna take attrition, then we can bring a second army in, and it'll be okay. Turn around and start firing. I feel like we almost have them. I mean, how much is left here, to be honest? There's a couple units over here. Okay, having to get out of there now. Maybe get in there. Mounted crossbows, that's fine. Wait, where's, where are my other cav, though? Uh, I guess most of them are dead, to be honest. There's one. See, I knew there was always, there's always one going off somewhere. I need you to demoralize these people here, because I'm actually not doing too well here. I thought I was doing this, but we just lost another cap there as well. Ugh, I thought I had it then, but now I'm starting to doubt myself again. Okay, you routed that unit. Fucking artillery being shot over here, impressively. Come back. Get in there. You are just going to have to demoralize these boys here, and that should actually probably... Well, that was not the demoralization, but... Do it anyway. That should get him. One would hope. The more generals I kill, the better. I mean, the more units I kill, the better, really. I gotta try and kill as much as possible here. And that's it for the units, just this unit and the general. 
En el general. We are not doing too hot here. Kill the trebuchet, that'd be worth unit to kill. A worthy unit to kill. A unit worth killing. Man, look at my fucking leftovers here. This is sad. Wait, what? Oh, you are back. Well, get back in there, son. What are you doing? Um, okay, he's running again. Go chase him. I would like to kill him off. Other way around. Oh my god, we lost our units there as well. This is actually now. And the trebuchet unit surprising me as well. So, so, some are still going. So, 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 some are still going. All right, easy. I mean, I was never even worried. You guys, you guys realize that, right? I'm, I wasn't worried about that. Clearly had that in the back from the beginning. <laughs> right. Didn't lose a general. Quite happy about that, it must be said. Now let's see what I can kill off. Try and kill off as many units as possible. Um, yeah, I can kill him off as well. I don't think I killed many generals. Actually, no, I think I killed... If I kill him, I killed three generals, didn't I? I think one of them got away. Yeah, that one. Oh, with no HP as well. That's unfortunate. Please do kill him, though. I beg of you. I have two units of cav left over, one of which is fucking moments away from routing as well. Alright, there we go. You're killing this unit or what? I like the infantry unit is not helping me here. So we're moving on to the next one. That, I think it's dead regardless. There went my other cav unit. <laughs> God damn it. I needed him. <laughs> Pretty badly. Ooh, you fucking slaughtered that action in there. That's good. Good shit. Anything else around here that's not mine? Nope, that's all my stuff. Go kill that unit then, please. What are you doing? You're chasing there. You're running over there. Well. Eh, it's running. Like a light jog, though. <laughs> Uh, are you murdering that unit? You're trying. It's a mounted crossbow, so it's not going to die very quickly, but... It is a worthy unit, uh, a unit worth killing for sure. I have heard that uh, ranged cav are quite good in auto results for some reason. We're not going to kill much here, but... That unit's probably already dead, but let's make sure. Let's confirm that kill. <laughs> I can't believe this is what I have left in this. <laughs> Actually one. Luckily we got the, the second army. I don't know how much is going to be left here, though. I don't know if I'll be able to actually just... Pyrrhic victory. I mean, if ever there was a Pyrrhic victory, that was it. I have about the same men remaining as they do. <laughs> oh, God. How many units are going to be dead? It's going to be the majority, I think. Come on. Not everything. Oh! Four units. Oh, my God. I got a thousand kills this one cap unit. <laughs> and then they died for it, too. That's just sad. 956 in that one, up to 9 experience, 144, actually did the best out of crossbows. Yeah, the crossbows got sniped, I didn't actually realize that was happening until it was too late. Not that I would have done much about it. They were in loose formation, so, I mean, to be fair, that one the best they could have gone, to be honest. Um, I am going to take the replenishment, I think. I feel like I need that. Um, how about I don't become your vassal, though? Ooh, he's stronger than I am, apparently. I'm recruiting a third army, aren't I? Well, well, well. I don't know if I can auto resolve that with this army. I may have to besiege it with the other army, just so I don't take the damage on the, the main one, because that will just kill off all my units, basically. Yeah, I was recruiting another army. Oh, an uncommon talent. What a surprise. Who, are you any good? Princess Pei Yumin. What the fuck? You got an actual princess here. Um, who would be quite good if she was anything else. The, other than a strategist, but a princess. What was that? What? How did? What the? What is? How does that work? Exactly. You're not in my family tree, are you? Are you in someone's family tree? No, because you're a character of no. Like you were, you were, you, 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 you performed well enough that we hired you. Also, why am I keeping you again? Oh God. Oh God. Why am I keeping this man? He's not that good. Did we get him as well just now? Are there two characters of note? Are you the... You're also Pei. Maybe this, Maybe they're married. Maybe I took them both on. <laughs> Fucking fire the guy now. I'm gonna fire both of them. She's not good enough. She's alright for what... Like, she has good traits, but not really what I need looking for right now. 
So you may both fuck off. I hope I didn't have him in an army. I don't think so. Nah, we're good. Alright. Go level up. Uh, I was going to say let's take the replenishment, but we already have that. Plus, he's not the leader in this army anyway. You are. Alright, well, we definitely want that, do we not? Yeah, I want to go around that way, I remember. Okay, well. Can you actually besiege this town while, while we're besieging it now? What is it? Medium losses still. Ooh, night battle. <laughs> well, maybe not. The thing is... They're not going to surrender. Could I just break the siege, just attack it with the second army alone? It is somewhat wounded too and will likely lose some of its units, but... Could also keep besieging them, but then there's the chance that they peace out during the end turn, and that'd be pretty rough. I feel like if I auto resolve this with this army, it's just gonna fully die. I'm gonna lose all my units here. Uh, I could fight it, but it probably doesn't have enough actual like breakages in the wall that I don't want to do that. Like there's gonna be too many towers still going. One turn of sieging would probably just kill them all off. But there's a, there is that legitimate chance that they just all survive. Or that they, yeah, they'll peace out and then I lose my chance to take this and they all replenish and it would be pretty pretty shit. Um, since we're already waiting for units to replenish anyway, fuck it, I'll lose some more units in this army. Maybe the AI is smart and used, nope, it wasn't. <laughs> used all my other units. Oh well. See Maloon, fuck off. Hey, another character. Or multiple. Alright, there's the first prince dead. Burning. Is he available to recruit? Wouldn't that be fucking crazy? No, he's gonna be in someone else's faction. Obviously, he doesn't, he's not gonna join somebody he hates, so... So you need to replenish, yeah, most of your units, unfortunately, but that's alright. I'm not gonna replace him, because that'll just cost more... It will cost me experience and money, but the money's not even that relevant. Although it is, isn't it? To range the damage, or do we go for the night battles first? I think we'll go for the night battles first. Foist. What do you want? Available army. Yeah, I'm fucking aware. I've also got very dead armies here. See, I think the next uh, next step is to attack this guy. We can take these two towns, like, instantly. Uh, how, you have an alliance, do you not? Or, yeah, you're allied to Sima Yu, but is it a military alliance, or is it a... Wait, what? Uh, hold on, I can see here, can I not? Uh, I need to know what you're... Yeah, there you go, Coalition. It's not a full alliance, so if I declare war on him, I mean, two vassals as well, but Shinji, isn't he all the way down here somewhere? No, that was, must be someone else, there's no way. Oh yeah, there he is, and then Simayan. He's the one down here. I'm who I'm trading with, am I not? Yes, I am. And with you, I have non-aggression, so if I do declare war on you, I need to break this treaty soon. This hair treaty. All right. Let's first go for all these messages. We are rivals of some dude, rivals of some other dude. We're the same dude, but the same different person. Gained okay, the honest trait. Well done. Character developments. Right, we recruit another dude. Let's have a look at him. Guanju. Fake Guanju. Oh. Help! Uh, nah. I need someone who's like brilliant or bright, something like that. Like some good traits, not this fucking trash that we keep getting. You were the one who's gonna get recruited into this army here, were you not? You were liked by one, but not by the other. Well, uh, oh, we got Kong. Oh, yeah, he's also liked by one person, but not by the other, so that doesn't really change much. So yeah, you're gonna go into this army here. Into this here army. I guess I'm gonna do this immediately. Immediately. Alright. Yeah, that's a lot of buildings. So we'll look at that in a minute. Friends. 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 Rivals. Lost relationship. Friends. And we gain this item. Fantastic. Leveled up. Commander secured. Occupation. And we're good to go. Right, this town is fucked. But that's okay. Wait, how much is this? 66, how much is that? 140, that will repair itself, hopefully this time around. So I'll repair that one, that one manually. I want um, basically the same as I'm building other food provinces. 
So I want that. I think there was another one I was actually further on, wasn't I? Perhaps not. Perhaps not. Oh yeah, this one. And I, but I didn't know what I was gonna. No, I was gonna build one of the temples or like one of these free buildings. Probably the temple. Oh, sorry, I just hit my leg. It was painful. No, it wasn't really. My fucking puss. Um. Yeah. I think this one because it gives research rate as well. Actually stacks up pretty nicely. Economic buildings reduction, which doesn't really help me much, but it's okay. All right. Um, so yeah, these are both gonna go the fuck away. Uh, no, I'm good on that. That's gonna repair itself. Right, we got tons of buildings. We did destroy something here, so we gotta build something up. So I guess that would just be the military infrastructure. Although we certainly have other things to build here, like the state workshops as well. This is gonna be just a money province, but it's gonna be focused on in, on uh, commerce first, which I mean, which probably means I should build this actually. But let's start with the military infrastructure. I think that's always a good one to have, regardless. We already built something there. Okay. Guard post upgraded right now, or do I leave it until later? Um, don't have that much money, so it's not a terrible thing to build. It's also quite cheap. Then upgrade that one. Yeah, I think that's. Wait, yes, the one in the Jason Commander is okay. And then I'm out of money. I just got to make sure I get the resource, the artisan's resource, so I can change that over. Okay, that's still eight turns. We also just generally have minus 15 from being a major strategic threat. How close are we actually now to Imperial Prince? Awful close. <laughs> uh, however, we are going to lose that um, 15 and we're going to lose 30 in three turns. But even then, we're still quite close. What does Imperial Prince get me again? Some good shit, I think. Give you a larger chance each turn of being... Well, we already are the region, so... We are offered missions awarding large bonuses to Prestige, which I... I mean, how... It, get, it gets me faster to Victorious Prince, I suppose, but I don't know how useful that uh, matters, or how, how useful that is. Taming this rank will be extremely difficult without first seizing control of the Imperial Capital. Well, we have, we are the region, so I think we have the Imperial Capital. Like, we don't need the Jin Empire Capital, we just need to control the Emperor, right? We control the Emperor. Right, anyway. Let's get you over here. And you're just gonna hang out in there, replenish for quite a while. You're also replenishing for a bit, so yeah, Oliver, we're just gonna replenish for a while. And then I think in the end we're gonna take uh, one army to take this, one army to take this, and then one army go across right away, and then the armies from here are just gonna go across, take Dong, and then start working our way through this guy. If we can strike fast and strike hard, we can do quite well. There's actually another faction here as well. He's only got an alliance of one or well. Not an alliance, a um, a thing with one person. Does anyone want to be my vassal yet? How about you, sir? No, it seems that you don't want that. Sima Yong, be a vassal. Will you be my vassal? I'm respected. Wow, fighting against the enemies of the of the alliance. Oh shit! I didn't realize you gained. Res I actually, this is interesting because I'd never gotten above zero. I I, I assumed it was possible. But I never actually saw it happen. Like, negative stuff just goes away by one per turn. I'm assuming the positive stuff goes by one per turn as well. But yeah, we are now respected. Alright. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah! Um, I don't even know who you are, man. You're at war see my way, so no, no, no. That's a big ol' no-no. Um, could support Fossil Independence of Qin Ji. And then we'd get pulled into a war with Sima Zhong, but... No! <laughs> no, we won't! Alright. That's it, boys. Let's end this turn here, shall we? Wait, what is this? What do you want from me? Are resources required? Yeah, I know. What about the other one? Damage building. Yeah, that will repair itself. I mean, it should do. 150 per turn. We are quite close to the Might and Spirit alignments, which I don't want to reach yet, because... It's gonna be negative, really, but... Oh well. Mm. No, sir. 
You are the vassal of the next enemy of mine. Ooh, I, I need to break that non-aggression back, though. I mean, I'll be, I'll be replenishing for a while anyway, so it doesn't really matter, but... Sima Marker to run a Jin Empire. Wow. You crazy bastard. You must have a death wish. Uh, reward the poets. What is this? A competition. Oh, it's this one again. Well, last time we went for the archer. I think we want to go for wealth? Yeah, that's not bad. Wealth or mind? Wealth cost me 300 bucks, but I got more happiness. Sure. 300 bucks is not really a particularly big deal, to be honest. Um, yeah, I just I definitely don't want might, and I definitely don't want spirit. Almost worth taking my armors out of town so I don't get the might upgrade <laughs> soon. Eh, yeah, minus five noble spores, actually not that bad. I think the other one, what is, yeah, 10% corruption. That's a lot bigger deal. Like, five, five happiness, I think we can handle. Anyway, we'll reward, reward them all. We'll reward them all. Uh, we don't have any people that really need that. Unless someone just doesn't have anything equipped, which is very possible, because this new army... Well, actually, we haven't even looked at his stuff yet, so... Here's a spear. You can keep your shitty armor. And then here's an expertise thing with resolve as well. That's perfect for you. And we have nothing for you there. So you actually have decent ex uh, expertise now. Yeah, you're unobservant. I forgot about that, but it doesn't really matter. And yeah, plus 10 melee evasion there too. So I definitely do want to go for high expertise with this dude. Go for higher armor, but then I lose this even more expertise. So I don't want to do that. Man, I don't want to do that. Wait. Wait just a second now. Um, yeah, kind of tempted to give the better gear to him because he's already got. Well, it doesn't give me more expertise, so it actually doesn't really matter. Uh, all right, so you've got some units coming back, and the next turn you've got more coming back. You, you were wrong. All the armies need to replenish for a while, so it doesn't really change much. Got to level up on um, Tofu Lady. That one, please. What is this? Right, so we went for the replenishment, but now that we unlocked other stuff, I might want to go for other stuff. Ooh, 5% corruption reduction. Uh, industry income, peasantry income, meh. Income industry, nah. Meh. Right, uh, no. Meh. I think the uh, corruption reduction is just something we gotta take right away, though. So we gotta take the replenishment later. Yes! Also, faction support is not bad. And an administrator position. That's actually just overall, that, that is all quite good. Holy fuck. Hello. You wives, intimidating and cool. You see, this would be, this guy would have been great if he was a fucking strategist, but everyone seems to be... Oh, wow, you're horrible. Everyone seems to be getting the, the worst traits for their particular class. It's Kung Fu, man. See, this guy would be fucking fantastic if he was a commander, and he's a fucking sentinel. What are you doing? You chose the wrong occupation, sir. Alright, I demolished a bunch of buildings. Let's go for the military infrastructure. That was the same place, of course. Um, let's build... Let's build that. And the shrine, yeah, let's keep going that extra research rate, I think. It's not a bad idea. I think I have enough money to build something else. Such as, let's go from the top. Starting from the top, now we're here. Uh, no, I don't want that, I need tea. It's not gonna happen for a very long time. People are gonna say, well, you should just upgrade it anyway. The thing is, if I do that, like I have many, like if I ever run out of buildings to upgrade, sure, I could do that. But right now I have plenty of stuff to upgrade anyway. Uh, where is this? This is in Zhongsheng, so that's, this one here. I'd rather do something that helps, like, towards the south. Like, if I could upgrade this farmland instead, get a... Yeah, we're already doing that, of course, but... Get a larger garrison there, that'd be more useful. Um, well, there isn't much I can do. It's either a lumberyard, which takes a long time to do. Oh, I have... Someone actually commented about the lumberyard upgrade. Uh, no, that must be in the base game only. I don't remember what they said, but there was something really good about it. But that clearly isn't in this game. That's only in the base game, I guess. 15% trade info is not. I can't have been what they said. That would not be worth it. Um, they commented that on my uh, 
Let's just upgrade this on a um, Ma Tong video, by the way. Because I, I again, this this episode is not start uploading yet. It is currently the fourth of August, and I'm not allowed to upload this until well, by now I guess you guys know it. So until the seventh, a day before the A Princess comes out. So this episode, what is this episode eight, is going to be out on the 15th or something. So you know, you guys are always behind already. Anyway, uh, we've done that right. I need to break my Welcome, treaty with you, unfortunately. He's gonna piss off his vassals. Whatever. whatever, dude. Do you think I care about that kind of shit, man? A lot of people want to get stuff with me now. For a second, I thought that's ever rejected. <laughs> you wanna, you want, you wanna diploma with me? Reject it. There's a lot of people here, maybe now compared to last turn. What happened? What happened, man? Also, you should be the leader here, I assume. Oh yeah, definitely. There's no way anyone has better stuff than that. Um, yeah, definitely here too. This one I think may have changed over time, but no, I checked this a couple times. And it's still her, I think. I, sp I think I. Yeah, I'm going towards those, and then once he when he gets there, we can make him the leader. But for now, there's no need. There's a Sima Jong army coming towards us. Why, hello there. Shan Yu, who are you? And where are you, most importantly? Like, there. You're not war of anyone that I'm like, so... 1180 bucks for, um... I have a lot of food I should sell. Oh, no, that's terrible. Yeah, I'll take that. Sure. See, my eye also seem to like that. But I think there were some other people that didn't like it for some reason. You twats. Uh, okay. Alright. Alright. So this is going to be the Confucian Temple as well. I, I think that's a decent building to build. Quite satisfied with that. Uh, trade port. It doesn't really do much. Well, later on it does do much. Level 5. Probably can't build that yet. We don't have any spice. We won't have for a very long time, if ever. So I don't know how worried I am about that. Uh, let's see what else we can build. Iron mine is level three there. Yeah, let's upgrade this. And let's upgrade more food or more food the other way. Yeah, let's go that one. And then that one too. Why not? All right, that's all my money gone. See you later, money. I'll miss you. You are replenishing just stupidly slow. You're basically done. Next turn you are done. Um, um, there's something I wanted to do this turn, but I kind of forgot what that was. And it makes me very sad. Um, I have no idea. What were my missions? Settlement administration, be a war stimulant. Well, that's not gonna happen. I mean, we already did that. I don't know why that wasn't even automatically completed. What the fuck, Zhang Fang? Trying to fuck me over here, huh? Give me some new missions. Oh, I can't next turn. All right. Yeah, there's definitely something I wanted to do this turn, but I've totally forgotten what that was. There's no diplomacy to be done. As far as I'm oh yes, yeah, sell food. Well, I don't think that was. I don't remember if that was what I wanted to do, but it sounds like a good idea regardless. Hey you, care for some food? No you don't actually, not at all. Yo, Jin Empire. Uh, I'm already giving you food, never mind. How about some food? Ooh, you fucking love it. You don't have that much money though. I could still give you like five food for nothing, right? Oh yeah. Oh, 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 oh yeah. All right, sure. It's not a lot of money, but have you got have you got any ancillaries? Take any ancillaries you've got off of you. Nope. Fair enough. I don't have any either. So. I mean, these jumps are huge. I could just give them less food, actually. Even less food. Yeah. Four food is fine, I guess. Get three hundred and fifteen for it for four food. Yeah, that's not a bad deal. If I declare war on Sima Jong, though, he might just join at some point, but. That's okay. See my eye. Uh, you have quite a bit of food, so you probably don't need this. 
Oh, you are rich as heck, though. Holy shit. Yes, please. I may have to give him quite a bit of food for that, though, but... Probably still worth it. Uh, no, I don't have to give him quite a bit of food for that. Okay, let's see where my jumps are. Is this point 0.1 every time? Yeah. Alright, well, let's just see how far I want to take this then, I guess. 3.0, that's a lot more food. Let's jump that down. 7 food for 405. Sounds good to me. Yeah, definitely, man. Um, Sima Ying, I already have a food deal with you. Jin Empire, I got trades of you. I got schemes. You are very poor on food, so you definitely want it. The thing is, have you got any money? Not really. Hmm. Unless, like, two food is enough to do that, but yeah, I don't think so. Um, Sima Zhang, you probably would take a decent deal. No, you won't. Never mind then. Fine. And I think, other than that, I think I'm okay with not selling any more food, to be honest. Alright, cool. Well, that should have increased my income a little bit. We're on 5666. That's not bad. Let's end the turn. Next turn, we'll get some new missions. See my Ying. Nope, that's the guy on the bottom left again. I have no reason to attack him right now. Just screw myself over, possibly. No reason to do that. Uh, you want peace, it's up to me to choose. Uh, who are you, exactly? You are... Oh yeah, Xu, Xu Yan, it's up there. Xu Yan, where, from whence do you came? Whom do you serve? Sharuba. Sorry. Um, what is your flag like? It's like a, it's like a white with this one right here, this is you. Okay. So you own a couple of towns down there. Mao Wen, Sima Wei are against it. Sima Ai and Sima Hui are for it. Uh, Sima Hui doesn't even agree if I... He doesn't even like me more if I do this. Sima Wei currently doesn't like me that much. So maybe I should... Uh, this doesn't make Sima Wei like me anymore, though. Um, sorry, but no, you guys got to keep killing him, I'm afraid. Mm. Okay. Uh, Cao Huan signed a peace treaty. Oh yeah, one thing we can do, of course, is just do an alliance war. I wonder if this would actually work. Uh, no. Oh my god, no. Alright, I'd have to do this one myself. Never mind then. Who are you? Wang Lan Yan. Uh, wow, okay. Why against Sima Ai? Seems like a nice dude. Uh, Ling Yu? No, I just... I'm looking for the right traits. If anyone has the right traits, I would consider. Did I? Yeah, no. Yeah, no. See you later. What have we got here? Uh, okay, okay, that's in a single turn. I gotcha. Fine, I'll upgrade that one. Get the shrine upgraded here too. And I've got some money left over. And level up for Fang Yangju. You're gonna go for not the um, Herpaderp first as well. Okay, we've lost our massive prestige bonuses now, so we're still only 70, uh, 83 away, so it's not really a big deal. Okay, Yan Men. Ping Yuan. That one's annoying. Right, let me first get some new missions, actually. That one's aborted and aborted. Government support. Grain storage. Raise a force. Okay. I'll see what I can do, my friend. Uh, I don't really care. That building is pretty shit. I don't want to build that. But I haven't got many more options remaining now. Yeah, let's build that one. Extra bit of food. And I think that's all my money. I can upgrade that, but I don't want to upgrade that. I've still got many more things to do. Right, so you're fully replenished. You are going to be fully replenished in two turns. You're still just... I don't know what the fuck's going on there with your replenishment, but it's not going very fast. I should consider replacing... Oh, actually, you're two turns away. Did I say that? No, I said one turn. Did I say two turns? I don't know what I said. I am considering moving this army over here and having it go across right away. Because there probably will be the most fighting around here, so we should use our best army for that. But I'll... If I consider... If I will end up doing that, I will just um, do the movement later. Because right now we're still having the mustering bonus, so I don't want to waste that right now. could start sending you down this way. But you can reach the farmland in a single turn from there as well, so it doesn't really matter where you are. I just have to get this one closer to attack immediately. 
I want to take three towns on a single turn. Although that is a large city, I almost want to consider bringing two armies over here first. I could perhaps even just have this army stand here. Now we attack. When we attack, we attack with that army. And then he goes in for reinforcements. And then he can still reach the farmland perhaps afterwards to uh, take those two turns in a single. Two, two towns in a single turn anyway. This one would all resolve that one with an actual battle. Yeah, that sounds like a pretty decent idea. When is the negative thing going away? Five turns. And then people will like me a little bit more. That's good. He's nice. Ending turn. Nothing to do right now but replenish. Unless someone decides to declare war on us, but I don't see that happening right now because we are all are strong. Do you want peace again? Still, oh man, see my eye. Went from 200 something to 146 in a single turn. What the fuck? Everyone's dropping down fast. Well, uh, I'm gonna reject again, I'm afraid. One of them is on plus 3.4. Hopefully that one just go away. I'm not even at war with you. <laughs> I like how I'm deciding in this war with someone I'm not even at war with. What the fuck? He wants a non-aggression pact with me. <laughs> I would piss off my mates even more, so no thanks, mate. But it's a, it's a nice fight. Uh, okay. Chinji requested their... Oh, okay, that's good. Sima Jong is at war with someone else right now. So he might be moving his armies away and then I strike him in the backside. Mao Wen declared war the Jin Empire. We did a mission immediately. We built a government support building. Hey, fantastic. That's exactly what I had in mind. I knew exactly what that was going to happen, so... I, I, I didn't know. Um, okay, that needs tech. Gotcha. Right, so we can't build that. We can build something else, though. That one? This building, that building is so cheap. I keep building that one. Go for the cheapo building here. And go for that one. And that one. More noble support law, so. If we do get this, minus five, which we're getting pretty soon. In fact, in two turns we're getting that. We're gonna have some problems. But nothing to worry about too much. I think most of our towns are more than plus five. Uh, yeah, there's a couple on like free or something, but could even lower tax if I absolutely had to. But right, so you need one more turn of replenishment. Um, it depends on who I'm gonna do this with, though. I need to wait anyway. I'm not allowed to attack him for an extra like for another two turns or three turns, maybe even. So I can't really do much there. Any other deals I might want to sign? If I could vassalize someone, I'd be all up for that, but... No one wants to be my vassal. You're like almost dead. Why can't you just be my vassal, man? Like, what's the problem? What's the dealio? Give you some food. Some items. I can take care of you. I actually, I could definitely get there. But that's Sima Liang. I mean, this, 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 well, this guy is... Is he even still alive? Where is he? No, I can't see his land anymore. So either... Oh, no, he's, he's got that one. Okay. I prefer, I definitely prefer making you my vassal. You have a legitimately decent well, amount of land still. Oh, that one's not even that difficult. Well, actually, depending on the food, how much do you value food? I already have a food deal with you, so not enough regardless. All right, never mind. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna enter, and I, I could consider recruiting another army at this point. I also need, yeah, I need to get this war started soon because these guys aren't getting any younger right now. He's fifty fucking seven years old already. You're 52, and Sima Lun, or Li Han even, sorry, is 55. Yeah, we gotta get the shit on the road here. I don't know how old my faction leader's gonna get. Ugh, I'm gonna have to replace him with my... My... <laughs> my son. He's so shit. I don't wanna do that. Alright, he survived another turn. Thank fuck for that. Uh, nope. Fan, Fan Minning. Again, like you'd be a great commander, but you're not. You got a grudge against Sima Jong. Oh, you do have all the good traits already, most of them anyway. Not bad. Not too shabby there, lady. Uh, yeah, we'd go for the food here, but I don't really need that yet. I guess I can build something else. That one, sure. Over Hiver, sure. That's most of my money. I can build the cheaper one, which is exactly the one I want. 
You are the one that I want. Okay. I got two assignments available again. Do I start making money or something, or do I just? I guess I was. Yeah, I was doing income from industry, wasn't I? I think that actually made a decent impact on my income because right now it's dropped quite a bit. Three eighty-three there, five fifty. Okay, that one's definitely one of the ones we go into. Tofu lady, you go to there. You go to there, and then we got Taiwan eight. Oh my god! I didn't expect I had one of them so high. Uh, yep, that's the, the other one, definitely. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, I don't know how much money that actually makes me, but it's it's probably a couple hundred, perhaps. Okay, our armies are now fully replenished, so... It is time to set the plan in motion. Or at least get over towards where I would have to be to make this happen. Uh, if you're gonna go take the farmland right away, you're still gonna cross immediately. You might just sit back, actually, and not cross right away. Although it seems that armies have moved away. So perhaps what I'll do is I'll sail over here and then we can take the trade port right away. Without first having to trespass. A good idea. Also means I don't get that quite yet, which is also quite good. I don't want to trespass here yet either, so we're going to be as close as possible. And hopefully still able to reach the farmland afterwards, like in a single turn. And then either next turn or the turn after, depending on when I'm allowed to attack, we will attack. Is there a large garrison in there? Nope, just the old one. So, we attack with two armies there. I'll still lose a fair amount of men, but it shouldn't lose me any full units, so... We'll keep that, keep up the pressure. Uh, you can actually attack that next turn as well, regardless, so that's okay. You can even sail a little bit further, I guess. I'm not worried about getting attacked here. Getting some extra information might not be a bad idea, seeing where his armies are. There's nothing in there either, so that's good. Yeah, because these two armies are going to take that and that, and then we're going to immediately jump onto Dong together as well, probably. As fast as possible. And then we're going to send one that way, one this way, likely. But it kind of depends on where the armies are of Sima Liya Jiong. That's the name. I knew that much. Okay. Man, that's a decent offer there, friend, but I piss off Sima Wei if I do that. I'm sorry. Do you have any ancillaries? We do actually have some ancillaries. That's a good ancillary too. I kind of want that one, my friend. How much do you value it? Just out of curiosity. Yeah, that's that's actually no. That's worth like four point something. No, it's not fair. That's it. That's that's fair, but that's that's almost the value of a silver item to me anyway. So no. You appear to be valuing it a little bit too much, my friend. Sima Wei signed peace. Sima Yan joined a war alongside Sima Jiong. Good. A potential traitor. Damn. Satisfaction faction wide is pretty good. Subtle. Ugh, I don't use spy, so I should go for might, but then I get my minus five public order. <laughs> or noble support. But I also get a bunch of other bonuses, which will definitely help as well. Execute them. Alright, so now we got minus 5. Oh god, yeah, it goes up to minus 10 after that. But how many points do I need? 150! Oh, that's surprisingly low. So maybe it is just 150 and then 200. Ew. Okay, well that does mean it's not that difficult to get up there at least. Which means that I'm not going to be dealing with... Because when you get to the max level, there's no negative effects anymore. So now you kind of want to rush to the max level. Which means I should really just recruit a single general in every single province. And there's no units, but just have them around there. That's not a bad idea. That ain't no bad idea. Um, I think that's actually a pretty good idea. Can you reach the... Oh, you can't reach the farmland. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. I think I'm not allowed to declare war yet anyway. I think we're still having to wait one turn. But I'm not sure. I really want to reach the farmland immediately. Um... You're going to use a normal stance. Yeah, we can attack that whenever we need to. Appears to be a difficult attack. Yeah, there's a large garrison there, but that's okay. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I definitely know I can attack next turn, so I think I'm going to wait one more turn. What I could do is I could trespass right now, then I can definitely reach next turn. It means I piss them off right now, but what does that really matter, right? In the grand scheme of things. Sorry about the trespass. I'm so, so, I'm so sorry, man. Please forgive. 
Uh, yep, upgrade that, because why not? And can't afford anything else. So we got five. But yeah, see, went up from like 4.4 .4 to 5 grand from the, those two um, two things that I did. And then you, I mean, I might as well trespass here too, I guess. Or I can just sit there and attack next turn. It doesn't really matter much. I guess just move up here. Okay, there's no army in there either. Well, at least not right now. I mean, it could be that he's on the offensive somewhere, but... It's also very possible that I'm going to see him again soon. Are you guys at war? No. Because that's Sima... Wait, hold on, is it? Sima way, right? Yeah, it is. Well, not him, the, not the man himself. Oh my god, look at this fucking shit going on here. They are at war. That's Sima Jong himself, or Jing himself right there. Also, just out of curiosity, I think it's the faction you gotta kill, right? And extra destroy all major factions. Yeah, it, it, you don't have to kill the actual character, you have to kill a faction. Which, to be fair, I feel like killing the character would make more sense, but... Then again, it would be more annoying as well. Maybe you could say faction or character. Because otherwise, like we killed, we didn't kill Sima Lun, so he's just going to be some other random faction, and I might even, I might never see him again. You know, it'd be very difficult to actually make sure he dies. Um, and also, I guess if Sima Young were to die of old age, then I wouldn't even be able to do this anymore. So yeah, I guess it has to be faction, not not character, not character. I can't believe that f that's going to go up to twenty percent corruption reduction. By the way, holy shit! It's a good thing I'm going for minus corruption right now, because that is going to happen in not, not in the not too distant future. Neat, 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 neat. <laughs> Sorry, got stuck there. Um, yep, that is going away in two turns. Great, just after I declare war on the man. You the man, Fanju. Who the fuck is that? Some random guy I don't give a fuck about, unless I'm trading with him. We're, yeah, didn't you offer me this before, and then it turned out I was trading with this guy, Fanju. Yep, sorry mate. You asked me that before. You actually, we had a really good deal as well. I was gonna get several fucking items from you and it was gonna be great. And then I realized I was trading with him and everything was ruined. I'm also gonna lose one trade when I attack here because uh, I'm trading with one of his vassals. One of, oh shit, I do lose the 10% extra movement. Do you, are you actually able to reach? Yeah, you are able to reach. I didn't think about that though. Blah. Blah. There you go, there's a corruption reduction. Didn't make as much money, but that's okay. That's alright, we lost trade with Song Wei. Who the fuck is that? Um, Song Wei. Song Wei. Okay, I guess he's, um, oh, he's over here. Alright, well, I'll probably break that trade and get trade with someone else as well. I got several traits to deal with next turn, next episode. Anyone good here? Ah, yes, brilliant. You are lame, unfortunately, but that's not too big a deal for you. Also superstitious, charismatic, eh. He's brilliant, though, and he's also got a whole bunch of level ups. Kind of poorly done, level 5, so 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. You can still get most of the good shit, just not that one. Um, yeah, I might want to hire this guy, actually. We'll have a look at that next time, too, but... And then there's Guan Chuan, who's careless. Nope. Get the fuck out of here. Are you one level away from this? Yeah, you are. That's not bad then. Okay, we'll probably hire him next time. Holy fuck. Energetic, trustworthy, bright, and dutiful. That's all positive. Oh, it's one of our kids. Oh, yeah. How old are our kids, actually? Oh, yeah. Alright, we'll have a look at that in a minute as well. Or next episode, I mean. How old are you kids? Uh, nine, eight, seven, four. Okay. Well, Sima Song, you're gonna you're gonna come of age, or you're not gonna come of age. You're gonna have to take over soon, I'm afraid. Unless I fire you and make someone else my heir, but I don't really have anyone who's necessarily better. So, anyway, next time it's war with uh, this man, Sima Jiang. Gonna take uh, three towns in a single turn. Oh, hello. So he's besieging that right now. Ugh, I wonder if it'd be worth waiting a turn so they fight that, because otherwise he might just back off. He sh no, he can't reach back in here in a single turn, though. This army is really inexperienced, though. That's what I'm worried about. And we're up against fucking good units over here. We're going to get some experience from this battle, but it's not going to be a lot. Eh, we'll see. We have a really strong character in there, at least. 
He's got 100 points. But then again, Sima Jong himself can have a lot of points as well. Yeah, I can't see, but it's probably quite a bit. Oh my god, his authority is insane. Holy shit. Anyway, next time. Until then, have a good day and goodbye.